It's like when you have sex with someone you don't want to have sex with and you pretend it's someone else. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I do know that. Have you actually. ever done that? I have done that. So, do you ever sometimes have sex and pretend there's somebody there? I do that. <laughs> Were you a cheerleader? Yes, I ah, was. Yes. In high school. Right. But I only did that to meet guys. All the cute guys were, were I'm just basically a slut, is what I am. <laughs> I'm basically a whore. And oh, I, you are not. And I play one on TV. No, so watch my no, show. no, no. You're adorable. You're adorable. This is going, my mom's going to watch this, and it's going to be just, between this and the making out with the women on TV, my family's just going to be So thrilled. proud. So, so proud. proud. So, Evan and Rachel, how, what's the film about, then? Well, let's see. Um, I play uh, Larry David's wife. Larry David must be, what, uh, 90? <laughs> I don't know. But, uh, yeah, I play a little runaway from Mississippi who ends up living with this stingy old Ebenezer Scrooge kind of character. This is um, kind of like my life, you know. Uh, <laughs> my wife is, is younger than me. Oh, well, that's fine. Yeah. Whatever floats your boat, man. Yeah. <laughs> What's the deal with the snake cup? What do you mean, what's the deal with the snake cup? <laughs> it's the kind of cup older men prefer. <laughs> a young man probably would use a regular cup, but young men know nothing Real in ways men of love. drink out of snakes. <laughs> oh, that's that kind reverse of thing. psychology. Yeah, so like, if I had a small cup, people would say, oh, he must have no room in his pants for totally, his cup. Totally, totally. <laughs> This is an interesting the, time with you. I know, man. I was going to say, Always. this is the most awesome interview we've I mean, ever had on this show. see this movie. Seriously. Yeah, no, it's a great movie. I, I've seen it. <laughs> you have? Yeah. <laughs> really? It was great. You were awesome in it. <laughs> so was the other, the other guy, Larry. Larry. He was just here, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. That's why I watched the movie. Because he was coming and I didn't want to know, know about his movie. So I watched it and you were there and you were there and you were there. And... <laughs> Really good, really good. Hey. Anyway, we're out of time, so um, there you go. <laughs> hey! You know, I'm concerned for you in this film. You're though. concerned? Well, you you yeah. play a Canadian. A Canadian. Yeah. I like the way you say it. Well, I I've practiced. Yeah. <laughs> Can you do a Scottish accent? <laughs> no. <laughs> You'd be perfect for Scotty in Star Trek, then. Nobody can do it. What? What? No, everybody that plays Scotty can't do a Scottish accent. Really? Except Simon Pegg in the new movie is pretty good. Uh-huh. If you don't need a band... I, d I do. <laughs> do you have one? See, again, do you have one? It's like so nice. Well, like no, I'm used to the way I speak. I'm used to it. I'm not. <laughs> That's strange, because I thought you watched the show See, every night. Yes. Yeah. No, but I have not had your mouth in my vicinity. Hello, hey. Now listen, your husband been here. Mm has -hmm. he? Yes, he was here. He was very nice. He's got tattoos, you know. Yeah, yes, my husband's colored. <laughs> He's from Austin, Texas. He's not. Isn't he? No. I thought he was from Texas. No. He's, he seemed a bit Texan when he was here. Oh, no, are, we, are we talking about the same person? <laughs> Hot sauce. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Is that a code? Are you giving me like a I'm just, hot just... sauce? No, no, what, my top comes off or something? <laughs> that would be great. I am not an English gentleman, actually. I'm a, a Scottish, Scottish gentleman. Scottish gentleman. Well, yeah. You can't be working all the time. What do you do to relax? What do you do to unwind? you go to the discos with the young kids and shake your freaky boogie? <laughs> I'm not sure I've ever heard it quite described that way. <laughs> um, I'm from another country. No. <laughs> Actually, I'm, it doesn't look like it right now because I'm. I kind of get dressed up and get feminine. But well, you look lovely. Oh, yeah. Thank you. But yeah. I, I, I'm kind of outdoorsy. And I don't know what it is about me and fishing, but whenever I go out, I always get a bite. I don't know why. I'll bet you do. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'll bet you do. Uh, I, I yes. said you were a gentleman. I am a gentleman. <laughs> I, I... So I got you. Don't tell me you brought haggis. I got you uh, somewhere I have here. 
Bring it out. Oh, yeah, really? Yeah, Joe, bring it out. There you are. There it is. Tigers. Look at that, huh? <laughs> well, that's the cake for dessert. That's a lovely haggis. Would you like a bit of haggis? Is it really haggis? It's really haggis, yeah. You've got to cut through the fleece uh, there. Did you make it? Uh, yeah. I, I, yeah, I did, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you want some? And may I compliment you on your amazing shoes. Thank you. They, that's really something you got going on there. I notice a shoe from time to time. You do? Well, you know, it depends. But yeah, look that? at that. Yeah, I can see it better. Leave it there, I can see it better. Did you think it looked? That's, that's an amazing shoe. Is that the, the Roman sandal they're calling that? This is sort of dominatrix. Yeah. Oh, I knew I'd seen it somewhere. <laughs> I've seen a rattlesnake in the wild, you know. When? You know, out there. <laughs> Well, what do you do if a guy's coming up netting on you and you're not interested then? I'm polite. Right. And then I stop talking to them. Is that rude? No, that's marriage. <laughs> <laughs> you're polite and then you just, so you just go, and they come up and say hi, how, right. Yeah. So I'm a guy, right? I, okay, let's, let's, let's so, right, okay. okay. So uh, you're at a party or something. Am I at you're a party? Okay. You're, well, or okay. you're sitting down somewhere with your big I'm legs there and I'm... Uh, <laughs> And I come over, and you think, well, is this guy interested? Or he might be. He's I'm got a dolphin. I don't see that. <laughs> All right. He's got a dolphin. He's got a little cow with him. <laughs> All right. So, hi. 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 Hi, I'm Craig. What's your name? I'm Moon. Are these your little friends? No, I, I only, I, I take them around so I can meet girls. <laughs> but really, I'm an escaped mental patient. <laughs> You cut women in I half. did. I cut Twist and Bell in half. I hate that you know the secret and I don't. I do know the secret. I could cut you in half right now and you wouldn't even know. <laughs> so jealous. Yeah, I know. I, I, I have special magic powers and you know why I've got them? Because I'm an American. <laughs> right, do you like the Magnum P.I.? I like the Hawaiian shirts. I've never heard of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're so funny. You should be on the television. <laughs> Are you a vegetarian? I'm not a vegetarian. Right, okay. I well, like a good piece of meat. Okay. Who does that right? <laughs> oh, oh, do you... Oh, no. I love Monty Python. Well, I... no, I, I wasn't thinking of a, a, a lumberjack sketch by Monty Python. I was thinking of this old cartoon they always showed between shows in the early morning cartoons in Canada. It was a lumberjack running on a lumber log. In It's going to go nowhere. This is going to go nowhere. Have I, you had any flu memory. medication? It's my memory. It's a Canadian thing. No, I get it. Listen, I... Everyone in Canada right now is going, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. The guy on the log and the lady and they dance. It's a good one. <laughs> Isn't she adorable? <laughs> I know! Me too! <laughs> Oh, gosh, you are adorable. I have to actually uh, keep going because it's the commercial breaks and then stuff like that. It's a shame you can't hang out. I would really like to sit. Yeah, say. I know. I could, sit, I could sit with you, you could interview, and I could sit on your lap. <laughs> Hello, George Clooney. George Clooney? Oh, jeez, you know. Well, didn't, you, didn't you say that in the beginning of the show? Just what, George me, Clooney? Call, well, me, call George. me George. Oh, no, don't call me George Clooney. I mean. <laughs> Call me George Clooney. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you think I meant call me George Clooney? Well, I'm not a supermodel for nothing. You're such a fool. Yes, you yeah. should. But you know what? It's what? okay, because I don't know that many other Scotsmen except for Scotty on Star Trek. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> He's not Scottish? No, Scottish. What do you mean? Canadian. Oh! <gasps> Travesty. No, 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 he wears men's clothes, but he's kind of... <laughs> oh, Craig, how about being single? Oh, you know what? I'm going to give it up pretty soon. Yeah? Yeah, I'm going to find someone and just marry the pants right off him. That's... What, what sort of women do you like? I like... I like tall women. Mm -hmm. I like women who are intelligent. I like women who are beautiful. But overall... The characteristic I'm looking for in a woman is lack of bitterness. Oh. <laughs> but in order to get a woman that's not even a little bit bitter, you might have to go rather low in age. I'll do what I have to do.